Hey dudes, what's going on? It's Drugs, and my voice sounds fucking shit-ass dick. Chocolate turd, uh, covered in vomit, horrible. <clears throat> and uh, the simple reason is because I'm sick. So, I don't know really, I, I think you, can, you guys can expect a few commentaries from me even with my uh, voice being as shitty as it is right now, simply because I gotta make a bunch of videos and pump them out. Not really pump them out actually, it's more like like slowly releasing them week by week over the course of my, my uh, college semester because I'm probably not going to be gaming nearly as much and I don't think I'll be recording or uh, recording gameplay or recording commentaries during that time, or at least I shouldn't be uh, unless everything is going fucking awesome but I did want to kind of make a video and show you guys this fucking awesome game but before we get into this game I wanted to uh, first ask how your guys is Christmas was, uh, how your New Year's was, and please, in detail, explain to me what you guys did. Even if you didn't do anything, let me know, because I'm curious. I'm, I'm, I'm genuinely interested in hearing what you guys have to say. Uh, if you watched a movie, or if you went out drinking with your friends, or let me know if something funny happened. Uh, I, I want to know, and because uh, you guys are bros. And uh, yeah, let me know. Also, let me know what you got for Christmas, what was the thing that you were most looking forward to, what did you actually get, uh, that'll be interesting, me personally, uh, I really had nothing to look forward to, I wasn't, I didn't really want anything, the only thing that I wanted was, uh, uh, Toxic, uh, 6950, uh, GPU, Radeon HD GPU, and, you know, obviously I was not at all expecting that, simply because that's a hell of a gift, and, uh, I told my girlfriend, definitely don't get me that, not that she was going to anyways, but um, the best gift that I got was probably uh, this this like seat cover for the back seat for your dogs to come uh, you know ride in the back and not dirty everything. That's pretty fucking useful. So that was awesome. <clears throat> but now let's talk about this game. Now that we got all that bullshit out of the way from me, but I am curious to hear you guys uh, hear what you guys did. So don't forget to drop that down in the uh, comments below. But this game, you're probably wondering what this game is, I'm sure the title says it all, but this game is called Serious Sam 3 BFE, and uh, this game is fucking awesome. The mo the campaign, I, I know this game has an awesome campaign, this game is supposed to be like a Duke Nukem knockoff, and for the most part it is, but it does it better than Duke Nukem. It doesn't have that iconic Duke Nukem symbol, Serious Sam kind of looks lame, uh, so I don't really know how the, the campaign is going to be, I'm sure it's going to be really good. But, um, the multiplayer is nuts. The multiplayer is fucking nuts, as you guys can see. It's like, everybody moves like three times faster than the TF2 scout. You can sprint, it's, it's prim uh, primarily and dominantly shotguns, but there are power weapons on the map that respawn, have respawn timers, much like Halo. Uh, I just don't use them, because I don't know how, and I like the sawed off. I like pretending like I'm a scout, uh, running around in this game. So that's the reason why I do that. Uh, the sawed off is really powerful. It can one shot kill people at a pretty decent range, whereas the regular I don't think can one shot. I think you have to be pretty point blank to one shot with it. But uh, the the regular one might have more range. I'm not I'm not sure. I don't know much about this game yet. This is actually the second game that I've ever played. And uh, if you know how to play Scout, you're gonna love this game. If you can play Quake, you're gonna love this game. It's just gonna be that much easier for you. It's really fast paced. You don't know. A Twitch shooter until you've played Quake or uh, you know some Unreal Tournament game. <clears throat> or, but this game is is pretty damn close to those games, if not even you know Twitchier. Especially when the this is actually this these lobbies are really small. There's only I actually started this server and uh, you know it was just me waiting and then someone joined and then another person joined. This this game isn't that populated multiplayer wise, and that's a damn shame because this game is so much fun. I mean. No, oh, okay, so this game is a lot of fun, and, and if you guys haven't bought it yet, it actually went on sale on the Steam sales for 20 bucks, it's normally 40 bucks. Uh, in my opinion, you know, if you had if you had the stupidity to buy Modern Warfare 3 for 60 bucks, then you should have no problem at all paying 40 bucks for this game, because this game is amazing. Uh, the campaign, from what I know, is very fun, it's very, uh, kill every fucking thing that moves alien, Duke Nukem style, but more action more enemies, more chaos, more mayhem, uh, so that's definitely fucking awesome, but this game, now, Modern Warfare 3, I, this game instantly is, instantly, 
30 times better than Modern Warfare 3. Okay, first of all, because it has customizable field of view and dedicated servers, which shouldn't even be a fucking feature, but you know what? Uh, it has that, so now we gotta be grateful for that nowadays. But, um... Secondly, you know, Modern Warfare 3, the thing that they tried to do with Modern Warfare 3 was make the game fast-paced. And they went about that by making the maps fucking tiny. Look at these maps. These maps are huge. There's only three of us in this lobby, but it's... it's There's only four of us in this lobby. But it's fast-paced as fuck. I'm never, you know, in a dull moment. I'm never looking for anyone. I just run around in a circle and I find one or two people. And that's really where I think that Modern Warfare 3 dropped the ball. If you want... This is... This is game developers if you want to make your game fast paced make everyone run at the speed of fucking light implement a sprint to make them run twice as fast as the speed of light give everyone shotguns and play some rock music and make everyone feel like a fucking sandy ravage and people will be running around the maps and uh and make the maps very simple to see people make people very visible and i guarantee you people will be running around your game like a fucking maniac whether or not they're doing they're going 10 and 30 or, or 5 and, and, and 50 they're gonna be running around like a motherfucker because you still feel like a badass even if you die repeatedly over and over just you know the rock music like gets you moving like it makes you want to run like who the fuck camps to rock music <laughs> I don't know of anybody that can do that but if you camp to rock music that would be a fucking funny ass video uh, a, a really lame uh, playstyle nonetheless but a funny ass video to watch somebody camping to some rock music but uh, yeah that's pretty much all I wanted to say if you guys are remotely interested in this game there's no way in hell that you're gonna be disappointed other than the fact that uh, during late night hours it's kind of hard to find people on servers but during daytime you should be fine with servers um, you know there, there are a lot of people playing and when there are a lot of people playing this game is nuts. There is shit going on everywhere. There's rockets flying everywhere, lasers flying everywhere, shotgun shells flying everywhere, assault rifle shells, uh, assault rifle rounds whizzing by your head every fucking .5 seconds. It's nuts, and I, I can't wait to post some gameplay for you guys of this game during peak hours because uh, this is actually the only time that I could play this game because I was, you know, at my folks' house the entire time uh, for about a week and a half, and that's why you guys haven't seen a video from me in that long. And uh, to be honest, you know, I, I don't really—I I found myself not really missing YouTube that much. As disappointing as that sounds, it is what it is. I just don't miss it that much. I didn't ever find myself really needing to post something on YouTube to maintain my channel or something like that. I don't know why that is. Maybe it's because, you know, there's I'm not getting that crazy support that I used to get when uh, you know, I had a little bit of views, uh, a little bit of subscribers. I've I'd have a ton of views and a ton of uh ratings. And uh, that's definitely something that can motivate me in the future to make a ton of videos. So please rate the video favorite. And thanks for watching, bros. Expect some more serious Sam gameplay from me. I'll catch you guys later. Peace out. This has been Jux.